Good morning. Look at that. With the, remember this park? We are officially, as of that sign, <laughs> in Winter Park. The Peterses oh, yeah. are driving us to Sarah's appointment. Ready to go see Dr. Loy? Um. You might see him walking in the halls. I don't think you'll see him. No, oh, yeah, do he will. It. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Our baby's asleep. And we're going to we see our other frozies. Our frozen embryos. We can't go in the, in the office with Sarah, so we're all going to get coffee with the sleeping James while Sarah's in there. but we got Starbucks while Sarah's in the appointment. We got a pop cup for James of whipped cream. You want some? All right, we're at East End Market. We're gonna get Gideon's for, for dessert and just bypass the whole Disney Springs thing. We'll probably go to Disney Springs at some point and get it, but we wanted, what's this place even called? I'm pulling a blank. Winter Park Biscuit Cup. Winter Park, we've been here once before. James just had a massive poopy diaper or poopy body. It was everywhere. <laughs> Changed his outfit, but we got... The Petrus's and Burkhart's are one and the same. We literally ordered the same thing. <laughs> one backyard burger, which is an impossible plant I did burger. get no swan on mine because I'm weird like that, oh. but... Pickles and, and Katie got the OG. But I did get uh, an egg added to mine. I did not. I actually didn't know what he asked. I just said yes. <laughs> and so I didn't realize until I saw the receipt that I said yes to the vegan cheese, vegan <laughs> egg. It looked delicious. Mm, last time we were here, they didn't have the gator sauce. And that's all, Sarah. And I'm covered in sweat because it's hot out and sunny and James was stressing when we were changing his diaper. But he's completely happy now. We got a good, got a good report on our ultrasound, which will give like a full update in a little bit. Yeah. This is one of the original Gideons. <laughs> And this is the insanity. Look at noon on a Tuesday. Zero line. Zero line. Look at this box of cookies. Oh, they're all wrapped up. I thought we were going to be able to easily show you them. Here's one coming. Oh my gosh. I'm sure it's. Did you say there's a Rocky Road one? Yeah. I think that's the Rocky Road one. Peter, give a shout. One of each. Walt Disney World! Booyah! 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 We're trying to go to Ohana. The OG menu Plot is twist. back! So it is much later in the day. James and I took a nice little snooze. Peter had a crazy day at work. Um, it's really, really hot out. Like it feels like over a hundred. And so we were originally planning on going to Hollywood Studios, but we're all kind of just like wanting to bask in air conditioning um, and eat some good food. So we are going to take our try at um, Ohana, the walk up, because there aren't reservations available, but the walk up says there is. Um, my ultrasound, I got an A plus of a grade. My doctor was really happy. There was no cyst, there was no fluid. There was nothing that he tries to take um, like a look at or like would cause red flags, especially after a C-section. It was cool though, you could see where my C-section was, but just like there wasn't a ton of scar tissue. It wasn't anything that he was concerned about. You could just like see where it was with the contrast and the ultrasound. Um, the bummer part, which like, of course I am very happy that the ultrasound went basically as well as it could. It was my doctor's words of an A plus. Um, the bummer part is that this technically wasn't a, like my first cycle because it was technically the pregnancy loss. Like it wasn't considered cycle day anything. This is unfortunately the loss. So we have to wait until my next cycle to do the procedures I need before transfer. So this chemical pregnancy did indeed cause a delay. Um, that we were hoping that we would avoid. So the timing of everything is still a little bit up in the air. We are here for four weeks. Hopefully it all works out. If not, we might have to tack on a couple of days, but like we really don't, we really don't know until we know. Um, the doctor did say that 
the chemical pregnancy is a positive thing even though it didn't you know it didn't end up going the way that we wanted it to um, he said getting the timing right especially with our past of you know never getting pregnant without medical intervention that it is a good sign um, but that it was most likely a genetic abnormality that caused this to happen and it was just the body's you know way of not progressing with with the pregnancy um, so kind of like good and bad, good and bad. Um, I was worried like I was worried the ultrasound because of having you know a little bit traumatic of a labor that that would cause concern um, obviously we are getting other procedures to look even closer before we do the transfer so like that doesn't mean that the hysteroscopy and the HSG are going to be perfect but it is a good a good sign now I talked all the way to the gates of Magic Kingdom now we're ready for a night of just relaxing Daisy, your first Ohana. How many pot stickers are you going to eat? You asked her at least three. <laughs> at least three. We're here a little too early, but we have a great view of some fireworks. But it'll be a beautiful view as it lights up. There's nothing. Okay, we might make that work. Oh yeah, there's a boogie. No, not a boogie bash. A boo bash tonight. You're a you're a. We still do fireworks. You're a boo bash. All right, we have some scones, coconut scones, and the house salad. And it's perfect timing because Jamesy Boy was getting hungry. The noodles, chicken, and pork dumplings have arrived, and we need a lot more pork dumplings. Here's the thing, Megan Peaches told me it was going to be the original menu, and so far there's been a lot of this that have not been the original menu, like chimichurri chicken, sausage, new bread. But like, I feel like it's everything that was here plus the sandwich. Yeah, I'm just giving them a hard time. <laughs> Wait a minute, is that the steak? Look at, that, look at that glaze on it. That looks divinity. No, you're not. You're not. This is too bad. You having a good time at Ohana? Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's loving the Ohana noodles. Yes. Is he a brat? He's a bit good. We also just got the shrimp, and we already asked for our second round of noodles and pot stickers. Pot stickers, noodles. Pot stickers, noodles. Pot stickers and noodles. He loves the Ohana. He's got that full belly dance. He hasn't even had the bananas fosters yet. Oh my goodness. He did have the outside of a dumpling. Uh. I'll be honest, James might be riding a little bit of his sugar high right now. You love it? We think we're gonna get our fireworks. Yeah, we're like, we're seven minutes away and we just got our press pot, haven't paid our bill, have our dessert. We're good. That's an Ohana baby. Spoon? Spoon. They're giving us. Uh oh. That was the first time, I think it was on yeah, camera. He's been doing just the uh, but that sounded like the full uh. Uh-oh. Say uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. We have half a banana sausage coming. The second banana sausage came. Megan's about to do it, but she better do it quick because priorities. <laughs> Happily ever after. 
Jamesy boy, you got a sticker? Yes. What? <laughs> you love that? You need a tiki themed room? Wow, you need to stay here? Oh my gosh. I think so. This is Megan's favorite hidden Mickey on property. I've never seen it before. That's so cute. I also. Polynesian is home to my two favorites, which is this one and then the one down at the Yeah, like the in lobby. the ground. You guys are definitely poly people. I know. <laughs> What's so funny? Their bellies are super cool. Is Katie so funny? <laughs> they got Coco going outside. Wow. So you're just saying how that Ohana is probably the Ohana we've eaten the least at, but that we enjoyed the most. It was so good. And we realized that Peter's very first time at Ohana was 10 years ago today because it was our Magic Kingdom day and we left the park to go to Ohana for dinner and watch the fireworks. And we did the same exact thing tonight, 10 years later. Crazy town. I think James has got a full belly. He's making like belly, full belly noises. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure if he was gonna share that this was the best but least amount he's eaten oh. on the vlog, but Sarah just decided for oh. him. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. there are no tears tonight. No tears. I ate the most I've ever eaten tonight, and I'm not okay. <laughs> Don't get me on camera. Oh. Peter's crying because he's so full. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I don't, yeah, I'm like okay. Like, I'm not uncomfortable. I just like never want to eat again. <laughs> Alright, we got two turns left. Me, Meg, and Katie are playing Mario Party. Katie's secretly destroying it, even though she's in third, third place. Second. Second place. Meg, you're in third. Robot's in fourth place. I am in first place. The Alexa's talking to me. Um, James is asleep so far. Sarah's been editing. I might just have a Gideon's peanut butter cookie. Did Peach just get a star? Yeah. I'm about to win. Tomorrow we move to a new... Location. Location? I'll get a haircut one of these days. <laughs> Same we always, the time. Yeah, but we always... That's the thing. It's like we love our time here. We love spending time with our friends. We gotta prioritize. Meg's about to get a star. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>